Okay, who's going to ask the first question, please? Shall I go as I'm unmuted? Yeah, yep. perfect. Um, well, congratulations, Scott. You must be delighted to have made it to the final. Um, how do you um, how do you just review the uh, the, the night overall? Uh, I mean, look, I think that overall, overall, we've uh, got ourselves to to the final. Uh, an incredible achievement in uh, in uh, an incredible achievement in terms of. Uh, a long drawn out season, 48 game that was tonight, and um, the goal is to, to the goal was to get to the final. We've done that. Um, I think the performance tonight and where we were was tough. It was difficult. Cardiff made it very difficult for us. Cardiff come here tonight with really it was a wounded animal after the first leg and had nothing to lose um, in, in, in that in that sense. And really, I probably you probably see the, the difference in the two teams that. Bit of an edginess to us. Obviously, goals change change that complex in, in terms of when they were scored. And um, like I said, they had nothing to lose tonight. It was they lose the game, they win the game. They're, they're heroes, and, and obviously, I think you sense that with, with the way they play, um, the way they play as well. That they, they constantly put you under pressure because they can put the ball in in the box, in, in your box, from literally all over the pitch. You, you get a throw in on the halfway line, and the ball's come in your box. And at times tonight, we. We didn't deal with that well enough, and I think we'll all, we, we all recognise that we needed to be better. Take care. You hear me? Yeah, we can hear you. Yeah. We, 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 didn't, we didn't deal with that. I think we'd be the first to admit that. And then it, it, in the end, it was about, I often talk about mentality and obviously about mindset. That's where it was. It was a roll your sleeves up. You need to do all you can to win this game because at the end of it, it's a massive prize, and that massive prize is a final it's the prize which we all wanted. We all want to, to have a chance and an opportunity to try and get into the big league. And um, in them moments, you've got to have a desperation, do all you can. Big players have to step up. Merrick Rodak pulls off some very good saves, keeps us in it. And um, yeah, we, we we end up we end up getting to the final, which is which is perfect. And I know it's obviously um, not long after the match is finished, but um, I know thoughts have turned to the final pretty quickly. Um, do you think you'll need to step up again to be able to beat Brentford? Well, yeah, look, Brentford are a very good side. I think when you play in this league, you, you always need to step up. You need to you need to produce performances, and um, we're playing against a very very good side. We understand that. Good result for them last night as well. You know, before that they've come off the back of three three defeats. Um, but like anything, the final is a final. Form goes out the window where you, where you are, um, and it is what it is. So. Uh, we'll, we'll go into this game fully prepared. We'll dust ourselves off. We'll re re regather, recoup, recoup, and, and obviously go from there. Okay. Any further questions for Scott, please? Last couple. Hi, Scott. Hi, Scott. Hi, Scott. Could I... Okay. Let's go with Jack. Jack yeah. Roster, please. Hi, Scott. I just wanted to check on um, Alexander Mitrovic. Obviously, left out again tonight. You said you'd assess him this morning. Are you confident he'll be able to play any part in the final? Yeah, I'm hopeful. I'm hopeful. He was he was close tonight, but not not good enough. It would have been a massive risk. He, he just wasn't fit to, to play. We pushed and pushed. We tried everything we can. Medical team have done everything they can. He just wasn't ready. Um, obviously, now we have... We have some time and some days, and and, and hopefully we can. Get to run. That's that's the next thing for us, really. So we um we're going to do all we can to get him out. There. What does he do over the weekend? Does he rest, or are you going to have him working to to try and get back fit? No, he'll be working. Yeah, he'll be working now, and um, we'll be getting hands on him, get get treatment, and obviously he'll be out there on, on the grass trying to pick up his work and um, see where he goes from there. And I think you spoke on the TV about wanting your side to have a, an ingredient in the final, a certain ingredient. Could you just say, explain what, what you meant by that? What sort of characteristic you want to see from them in the final? The ingredient I see at times tonight. The ingredient what I often talk about, and that ingredient is a, is a real mentality about you that when the going gets tough, football matches, at, at some points in football matches, technical ability, what a player you are, what qualities you have, whether you've got skills or whatever they are, go right out the window. There, there's always points in football matches which is nothing to do with tactics, is nothing to do with technique, is nothing to do with that. It's to do with a, a mindset. It's to do with an understanding of the moment. It's to do with 
right, you know what, I need, I, I need something what I need to fall back on. And that was a prime example tonight. In the first half, it wasn't like that. They scored, but we had our quality about us, our technique, our quality, our structure, our control got us through that half. The second half was totally different. The second half had nothing to do with, with that. And it was that moment. That you hope that maybe there's only five-minute moments. There's five to minutes spell. The last parts, it was that moment, which was not about. It was about, you know what, you got to do what you got to do to win a football match. You've got to do what you've got to do to literally get through this game and get to a final. And we did that. And um, that's going to always happen. Always happens in football matches. And that's constantly my message to this team. And um, if there's sometimes what we fall short of during this year is their moments. And that's the part of developing teams, developing mentality. Um, and, and, and that's what we need to understand. Cheers, Scott. Congratulations. Jack, yeah, thank you. Thanks, Jack. Can you go on mute? Uh, can we have a last couple of questions? I know it's dragging on this evening. Uh, you've got deadlines. So are there any further questions for Scott? Hi, Scott. Can I just ask very quickly about um, your goalkeeper's performance and obviously that save sort of midway through the, the second half, which was a, a pretty standout moment in the game. Yeah, fantastic. Um, he put in a big performance tonight when he needed to be, um, when he was called upon and he needed to he need, he need to pull off his saves and he, he needs to keep us in the game. He did that. And he's done that throughout the season, to be fair, at times this year. And that's what you need when you're under it a little bit. You need certain players to step up. You need them to pull off saves. You need defenders to to win headers. You need blocks. Everything else, what comes of it, um, he did that. He was fantastic, and um, yeah, he deserves large credit for that for the result. Okay, if there are no further questions, thank you very much. Uh, good evening, everybody. Thank you.